It's, it's Vlogmas Day, day 14. 14. Hello everybody, this is Shani. Hey y'all, this is Tuan. And today we're going to be making Greek spaghetti squash toss. First time we're gonna have chickpeas with this. First time ever doing Trying chickpeas. chickpeas. So no, not for you. You had hummus. Yeah, but that's chickpeas. I've never had hummus. You never had hummus. Never had hummus. I don't remember having hummus. He's but had she it. said I had hummus. He's had so it. It was on a burrito. We got at some vegan spot. And he had it. But yes, yeah, so we're gonna make that. We're gonna be making it for the first time. Yes. So now on to the video. All right, what I'm going to do right now is we've already cut and cleaned out the squash and and, um, and place it in the oven for 45 minutes till it got soft enough to be able to scrape the um, squash out into spaghetti strings. Spaghetti. Spaghetti strings. So I'm going to do that now. I'm going to place it in this bowl here. And as you see, it looks stringy. And you're going to scrape it all the way down to the skin. That one. I want to get the next one. Okay, so first thing we're going to do, we're going to add the, the pan is on medium heat. I can feel it. The oil is, is hot. I'm going to add in the garlic and onions. And we're going to saute this for four minutes. It does smell really good. It smells great. Think about those onions and that garlic. Okay, so now it's time to add in the chickpeas the tomatoes and the thyme. And we're gonna let that cook for a minute. I'll bring up the heat just a little bit. Turn you over. I like 
grilled tomato. Don't mind that echo. the um, spinach and the spaghetti squash for probably about another two minutes until the spinach is wilted. What I'm doing right now is, is separating the spaghetti squash from itself so it can mix better. It looks pretty. Let's just hope it tastes pretty. <laughs> I don't know, y'all. I don't know. Now I'm adding a little salt. Turn up the heat so the spinach can start to wilt. Alrighty. We are done cooking. Now, it didn't take long. It didn't take long. No. It was a very quick no. meal. Um, now we're about to try it. Dum 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 dum. I'm gonna apologize in advance for my facial expression. Never had spaghetti squash. No. Never had a chickpea. And I don't like tomatoes. They're all on my plate. <laughs> but I only gave her one. I only gave her uh, one tomato. I'm going to try this. So again, I apologize in advance for my facial expression. I am going to go ahead and try the squash and spinach first. And then I'll add a chickpea. And then maybe I'll take a bite of this tomato. So again, I apologize. I'm going to try it all together. Here we go. You ain't got the tomato on there. You ain't trying it all together. That's too much of a bite. That's too much of a bite. No, no. We're going to do, we gonna do this. Yeah. There we go. Okay. I'm going to give the squash and the spinach a 95 out of 100. Okay. Me personally, I let him cook this. Me personally. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you leave? Uh, Don't leave. I like this is more salt of salt and pepper. This is me. This is more not a lot, but it's okay. I can tolerate it. I won't like my gosh need some salt. I'm good with this. So now on to chickpea with the spinach. It's not. It's, it's not bad. This again. The chickpeas came out of a can. I don't do canned stuff very well. Black beans is different, but you smush them up and they go into burgers. So we have this chickpea with some squash and some spinach. I'm so scared, y'all. <laughs> oh, no. Let me get some more. Um, I don't try different food a lot. I'm so scared. Oh. We are waiting. We are waiting. <sighs> I can't <see> it. <laughs> Oh, Jesus. 
Okay, 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 y'all, okay, okay. Hmm. It's kind of like that jackfruit pulled pork thing. <laughs> <laughs> my mind is not allowing the pork to enter into my mouth. Okay. Um. um all right, all right, I'm gonna do it. why people I know put it in curry because I can see how it would go well in curry okay I'm scared it keeps falling so that that means I'm not supposed to eat it all right y'all and this is all juicy and stuff oh okay I feel like I need something with it <laughs> let me add some spinach and squash onto this little bite that I'm about to take Yay, she did it! Honestly, I ain't never eaten that again. It don't taste bad though. I just don't like tomato. Until my mind gave it off of that. It don't taste bad. Like, it brought a whole Italian thing to life here. Um, now, this recipe was called Greek mm -hmm. spaghetti squash because you can add feta cheese on it, but we opted not to put the feta yeah. cheese. So if you want to add feta cheese, by all means, add feta cheese. 